You know what? That wasn't cool of me to pressure you. You take your time. And if you've never been to a concert with me, you are in for a treat. I yell constantly! Hello? Yes? Oh, my God. Oh, sorry. The calendar was a month off. I thought it was my father's birthday again. Now, who is this and why are you calling? Oh, my God! You were his emergency contact. We didn't know what else to do. What happened to him? Well, take a look at this security video. He arrives with this family at 9 a.m. Churros, elephant ears, the whole nine yards. By 11 a.m., he was in line for the flume, which he rode 16 times, all with different families. Uh, two hours later, he's puss in boots with yet another family, eating a caramel apple, watching an animatronic bear play the fiddle. As the day progressed, he was with nine more families in nine more outfits, the rights to which I doubt he owns. Uh, until we found him like this, gurgling, slumped over a teacup, and urinating on a pinwheel. I went on a family bender. I have a problem. <laughs> Help me. You're here for me after all I've put you through. You're good, simple people. You're an addict, Roger. But luckily, we found someone who can help. Remember where you got your retainer? Upstairs from there is a psychologist. And what's upstairs from there? I think an SAT preparation class. All right, I'll go. Everyone, this is Roger. Yay, he'll be joining us. Roger, why don't you tell everyone what your expectations are for group therapy? Okay, first of all, I don't believe in any of this therapy nonsense. <gasps> the Logans! Oh, my God, the Logans! They were the first family I ever lived with, and then they abandoned me years ago, and I haven't been able to trust anybody ever since. Thank you, Doctor. You are a miracle worker. You see that, people? That's how you share. That's a freaking breakthrough. Mm -hmm.